Oh, whoa. Everyone. Welcome to another product review on the 1986 Bet Sacri channel. Sacri on Bet is your host. And today, I was I was down in the, in the closet in my bed, in the bedroom and look what I found. Always smokers. It's the um, back to the groovy Cincinnati style chili flavored potato chips from Mike Sells. Bought this at Myers for three twenty nine in Mansfield, Ohio. And this is a classic hometown flavor from down from Cincinnati. If you look at this picture, got a big bowl of chili. It doesn't have beans in it. And this is our classic hometown recipe. For all you people who love Cincinnati style chili, like Skyline chili, or Gold Star chili, if you like, if you like, you could be in for a special treat. So, before we get to that, I want to take a little bit of just take, just, um, Let's get a little bit of history about Maxwell's potato chips. This is the, um, this is one of the oldest potato chip manufacturers in the United States. It's made in Ohio. It started when D.W. Mike Sell operated business with his wife, selling dry beef and sausages from two rooms on South William Street in Dayton, Ohio. And the opportunity came when he bought, bought some, to buy some potato chip equipment, and the Mike Sell's potato chip company was born in 1910. Excel Company was, was so a need for a unique logo back in the 1920s. It was for, it was designed on play on words using the Mike Cell name to be used, used which is a hyphen which was added in making the trademark Mike Cell's name. The hyphen remained for over 85 years. And back in 1965, D.W. Mike still passed away in a, at the age of 82. And Mike still's chips today as I mentioned before, is the dedication to bite to quality set by Daniel Mike who has helped us remain as an industry leader and, be, and one of the oldest strategic manufacturers in the United States. For especially 105 years. So, Let's, they had the uh, Mike Sales logo, which was the Mike slash Sales. It lasted until 2010. Now it says, now in the box it says Mike Sales. So, pretty interesting name. So, so look at this back of the, if you look at the back of this, uh, Bag. It says very few things go better with a bag of Mike Sells chips than a bowl of Cincinnati style chili, three way, five way, or any way you like. In fact, we love it so much we got to thinking. The zesty, spicy flavor brings out the brings out the best in our signature chips. It's the world's best chili flavor on the world's best potato chip. 
So, with that being said, let's open the bag. Nope. This aroma is amazing. If you try to, and even if you try to, Guinness uh, Burt's Rich Chili Flavored Potato Chips, this could be the right thing right here. You could be in for a special treat. So let's open up one of the bags. Smell this aroma. Here's one of the chips out of the package. Almost a distinct flavor, not as, but not much as distinct flavor with the Burt's uh, um, potato chips, the rich chili flavor from Guinness. But this, a little bit different. So I'm gonna give you a close-up look, see how the chips are. Okay. Here's the chips out of the package. You can see it's coated with the Cincinnati um, style chili f flavored season. So, got a few out of the bag and already um, into my hand. So, look at that. This is a nice presentation. I always smell the aroma. It doesn't have the extinct flavor. Or the distinct flavor, like the uh, like the Guinness um, Burt's Rich Chili flavored potato chips that I bought at World Market. So here, this is, we're already let's take let's go in for a bite. All right, we've already been in for a little close up. Let's take a bite of these chips and see how this tastes. The zesty, flavored, flavored chili aroma in those chips. Let's take a bite. Let's see how it is. Wash it down. Got a little bit of the uh, Mountain Dew Code Red left. Let's um, wash it down with that. So, let's take a look at the nutrition facts. It's serving size one ounce, about 17 chips. It took four of the two. Ate four chips already. 150 calories, 80 from fat. So it says nine grams of total fat, no cholesterol, 200 milligrams of sodium, total carbohydrates, 16 grams, one gram of dietary fiber, two grams of protein, and only 2% iron. So this is an unhealthy product here. We'll put another bite. This tastes so good. Go for another bite. Robert Dyer, what do you think about this so far? And also Jackson Slayer. 
How do you, what do you think so far there, Jackson? Practice? So anyway, pretty good stuff. So anyway, it was a pretty good product. And like I said, it's not the uh, almost a distinct flavor to the uh, Guinness um, Burt's Rich Chili Potato Chips. So, um, so on a rating scale, I would give this an 8 out of 10, and I would give 4 out of 5 stars. So, so, hope you like this video. Please share it with your friends. Subscribe to my channel. Favor the video. And please write a link on this, on the uh, video on the video below on the thing below on my channel. And I'll see you next time. Um. Next time, and that's it. And thanks for watching. Zach Bits out. Remember, keep your stick on the ice.